check out these vintage original Nike discos from the 70s. These shoes were made for dancing at Studio 54, and this pair was actually purchased from a Studio 54 dancer on eBay. He said he wore this pair of shoes just four times to the club to dance in and has kept them in storage in his attic ever since. I was so excited when this pair of shoes turned up on eBay. They're size men's 10 and a half, and they're in remarkable condition. I wanna bring them up close so that you can have a look and see some of the remarkable details on this pair of shoes that really captures the essence of the 70s, which was the disco era. Remember that Nike got its start in 1972, and the Shoeseum was all about curating the history of Nike, but using Nike shoes as a springboard to talk about pop culture and everything going on in the world. So these shoes were pivotal in the Shoeseum. The Shoeseum was all about capturing the essence of each era, and what better shoes than the Nike Discos. Look at the metallic silver upper. It just totally shimmers. And even the glittery red swoosh says Nike back here in big, bold capital letters. You'll notice that the logo on the tongue says Nike also in those big, bold capital letters. This is something that Nike was doing in the late 70s. One of the really cool features about this shoe, in addition to the shimmery metallic upper, and by the way, check out those metallic laces, is also the outsole. Have a look here. The outsole has glitter on it too, but you're gonna notice that there's absolutely no tread on here because these shoes were made for dancing and also for moonwalking. So it wouldn't have made sense to put tread like waffles or something else on there that would keep you from being able to dance. Another really cool thing about this pair of shoes, check out these little smudges right here. They're actually little cigarette burns from being put out on the bottom of a shoe. And I just sort of picture somebody in the 70s with a big popped collar, rocking these discos, flicking a cigarette on the ground, stamping on that cigarette with these shoes. It's just so crazy. I actually love that those little marks are on there. I think it really gives the shoes a lot of character. But look right here at the midsoles and at the upper really, really remarkable condition, especially for a shoe as old as this pair is. Let's move this one out of the way and have a look at the other shoe, which is just as nice. I mean, wow, the guy really only wore this shoe four times to dance in. And I feel like the fact that these shoes were owned by a dancer at Studio 54 makes them even more special. There's some vintage pictures of Michael Jackson wearing this pair of shoes. Also, David Hasselhoff, a picture of Mr. T rocking these shoes back in the day. Check them out. Gorgeous. Look at that shimmery metallic upper. Anyway, it's been a real pleasure sharing these Nike Discos with you. You can see right here on the bottom of this pair, there's another one of those little smudges. You gotta love it. I'm telling you, the cigarette marks give the shoes character. Anyway, it's been a great pleasure walking you through these vintage original Nike Discos. I really feel blessed to have my hands on them.